Hi everyone and welcome on AirvéCuisine.com. Tomorrow I have some friends coming home and I'm going to prepare for them a bœuf bourguignon, a typical bœuf stew from the Burgundy region in France. In order to make this recipe you will need the following ingredients. First of all, you will need 3 pounds of beef. You can choose shoulder, for instance, cut into pieces and you will also need some bacon, 6 ounces, one big onion, two garlic cloves, two leaves of laurel and some thyme. You will also need a quarter of a cup of cornstarch or flour and three tablespoons of sugar and lots of vegetables. You will need two pounds of carrots that you will peel and slice, one pound of mushrooms and two pounds of potatoes. Of course you will need a bottle of wine, red wine. I will start by eating some olive oil in my saucepan and add the beef that I've cut into two inch cubes and I will leave it until it's browned. Okay, you remove the meat and you're going to use the same saucepan to add the bacon. For the bacon you will slice it into small pieces and you will cook it for a few minutes, like 3-4 minutes until it's browned too. All right, while the bacon is cooking, I'm going to you to prepare the vegetables. So I will start with the onion that I'm going to slice thinly. See my nice ceramic knife. And now I'm going to take out the carrots. So you're going to peel them and slice them. Same for the mushrooms. Well, I've now removed the bacon from the saucepan and I will add the onions. The onions will cook in, um, in the fat of the bacon and the olive oil that is remaining from the beef. All right, I will let the onions for a few minutes so they will start to caramelize, getting a nice brown color. Okay, so I've taken care of my little carrots and I'm going to add them to the onions also. Okay, I've decided to uh, slice them that way. But of course you can just make regular s slices. Okay, so I will add them now and cook them just five minutes so they get a little uh, brown color also. Now I will add the sugar. This will help caramelize and it will also help um, balance the um, acidity of the wine. And now uh, I will add the cornstarch or the flour. This will help getting a nice thick sauce at the end. Okay, keep on stirring and cover with the wine. So you're going to pour a full bottle of red wine. So try to choose a young wine. Burgundy is best for this recipe, of course. Okay, this will cover your vegetables normally. If it doesn't, just add some water and bring it to a boil. Once the wine starts to boil, you will add uh, the meat and the bacon and let it simmer for two hours on low heat. This is the traditional way. Alright, after two hours, 
Look at the soles, it has thickened, starts looking very nice and smelling very good in the kitchen. So it's time to add the potatoes and the mushrooms. So for the potatoes, this is a, a kind of potatoes you can leave the skin on. So I just slice them into big pieces and I've sliced the mushrooms too and cleaned them. So I will add the vegetables and let it cook uh, for one more hour. I know, I know, you've been waiting for three hours, but look at this beautiful bœuf bourguignon. I'm adding a few leaves of fresh parsley and this is ready to serve to your guests. So very nice little mushrooms, bacon, very tender pieces of beef. Yeah, this is delicious. So thank you for this recipe. It's been presented by Hervé from HervéCuisine.com from Paris, France. I hope you will enjoy it and I will see you soon for another recipe. Bye bye.